The movie Solo A Star Wars Story follows the adventures of a young Han Solo. I'm a driver. He barely escapes his grungy, crime-ridden home planet of Corellia. He goes to war as a grunt in the Empire's army. He stumbles across a group of smugglers and their wily leader. If you come with us, you're in this life for good. And he's almost ripped apart by a half-starved Wookiee. <laughs> but that's nothing for a guy like Han. He specializes in small-time thievery and big-time trouble. You think everything sounds like a bad idea. He's smart, he's reckless, and he's determined to keep moving toward his big plan. I waited a long time for a shot like this. And if you watch closely... I got a really good feeling about this. You might see him become the galaxy's greatest pilot if he doesn't get himself killed first. Since when do you know how to fly? <laughs> 190 years old? You look great! Fans who cut their teeth on the original Star Wars trilogy will very likely appreciate what director Ron Howard has done with his prequel to Star Wars Episode IV. It's a tale that spins, soars, and blasts like a Millennium Falcon. That said, there's lots of fairly violent peril here for parents and kids to navigate. Han himself is an anchorless scalawag, and there is some mild profanity and innuendo in the mix. So I'll give Solo a Star Wars story, three and a half smuggler shootouts out of five for family friendliness. For more on this film or anything else at your local box office, visit us at PluggedIn.com. Plugging you into the movies? I'm Bob Olszewski for Focus on the Family's Plugged In Movie Review.